squeezing to this size zero dress. I don't know why I'm wearing a size zero dress. I bought this dress years ago thinking, oh, I could just, it'll be fine. It'll fit. It looks loose. Girl, no. Girl, no. I was sweating just to squeeze into this dress. But hi. Hi. Hi, friends. On Yuko here. And today's video is all about the best first dress at the Elmfar Gala, which took place at Con Ross, girl. And they came through with the looks. So you know I had to do the same. I'm a, I am I had to do the same. I'm a little dis disheveled. I'm not even going front. I'm going to just do this. <laughs> I would stand up, but girl, I'm, mm, I got makeup stains on this, putting this on. I went through a lot, so we just gonna sit down and talk about how fine I look. I look good. <laughs> Welcome to Best Wish Dress, where I talk about the Best Wish Dress at any event or any occasion or whatever. <laughs> girl, I give my two cents on what people are wearing and what I think about it. Yes. Make sure you subscribe and turn your notifications as well. Follow me on all my socials, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, all those cute little places. All right, let's get right into it. My earrings are the Marvel Mint Earrings from the Befitting Style Bliss Collection. It's a brand new collection that just came out. They are handmade by Mwah, darling. Very excited about these earrings. Very happy about them. You can also check out the video that I made talking about the different earrings from the collection. I'll link it down below. Okay, let's get right into it. So first up we have Barbara Volante. Barbara Volante is wearing Bottega Veneta. I'm not crazy about her look. I think it's borderline almost too casual for the event. Everybody else came to slay and she's giving me... I'm meeting my boyfriend's mom for the first time, so I have to look really good, but it's not a gala. You understand what I'm saying? That, that's just how I feel about this look. That's how I feel about this look. Corrine Rothfield. I did not like her look at all. Wow, I thought I... I mean, it's just... Mm, top four. She's wearing top four for winter 2020. I... Oh, wow. On someone else it would look more like upscale. It's just not, it's just not looking upscale on her. I really don't like it on her at all. Wow. I don't know if it's the, if it's the leg detailing or if it's that detailing right up here. I don't know what it is, but I just feel like she would, she would look better with something a little more simpler, a little more structured maybe. I really don't like this look on her. I wish she did her hair differently as well, but you know, whatever. Cindy Bruna came through in Jean-Paul Gaultier. This is what I'm talking about. This is a look. This is fashion. This is style. I love it too. Yo, she looks so good. I want this dress. I want this dress. I think I deserve this dress. I deserve every bit of this dress. I do. Who gonna tell me I don't? Hannah Cross looks amazing. Yes, we can say this is a simple little two-piece. Mm -mm -mm, but I do feel like the long skirt, the sh the, the, the crop top. I like I'm feeling it. It looks great on her. Somebody else would be too simple, but on her... Perfection. I'm all the way here for Jessica Wang and Nicholas Jabron. <laughs> what? You want to talk about style? You want to talk about putting in effort? Oh, oh my gosh. Aquazura heels. Oh, my goodness. She looks amazing. Amazing. It's the black and white for me. Was black and white a theme? A lot of them wore black. I'm not sure why, but I, it just looks amazing on Jessica Wang. Julianne Huff looks great in Off-White by Nicholas Gibran. I love this on her. She looks amazing. She looks elegant. She looks sleek. Oh, oh, oh. come on, Julianne. Come on now. Bulgari Jewelry. Hello. Mariah Bakalova. Am I saying her last name right? Bakalova. Hey, Bakalova, Bakalova, Bakalova. I might be saying that wrong. Let me shut up. Mariah. Mariah looks amazing in Giorgio Armani. That is custom Giorgio Armani. This is a velvet dress with a pink crystal bodice. Oh my gosh. She looks amazing. She looks great. We love a custom moment. We love an Armani moment. We love this entire piece. Period. MJ Rodriguez and Etro. Fab. Fab. I love. I love this. I love this entire look. Oh, honey. I'm here for Nina in this in this black dress. Like I'm I'm all the way here for it. I think that it's it's just perfect. It's perfect. It's the lines. It's the lines. It's the shape. It's the silhouette. Oh, it's the silhouette. Oh, I love this custom Vivian Westwood dress on. Oh, actually, no. I love this custom Vivian Westwood dress. Just just not on Rachel. I don't like it on Rachel. I think the color is washing her out. This peach color is too peachy for her. I would like something else on her skin tone. I would like something else on her. I just don't like this peach on her. Style by Laura Roche. Laura Roche is an incredible stylist. He also styles Zendaya. But I just feel like she would look better in something else. But I do love the dress. Just not on her. I love it on me. <laughs> I mean, does Regina King ever disappoint? She's wearing Chipparelli. I, I mean, like, 
oh gosh stop a woman in Makai I always love Regina King's looks I don't think she ever does any wrong like ever like she's just an amazingly styled human being women in Makai never misses with her they didn't miss this this time they haven't missed other times they this is incredible always coming out looking like a queen a queen that she is Aaron Stone came through in the purple ah! bland and boring I don't know I'm not crazy about it what do you think I'm not crazy about it like uh I guess it works you know what it works it's the feathers it's the feathers on the pleats I don't know how I feel about feathers on top of pleats I don't know if that's maybe a little mm -mm for me but I don't know let me know what you think Stella Maxwell and Versace Versace Ver Versace Versace eh, Versace Versace eh. I like Stella Maxwell and Versace. I think she looks incredible. I think she looks chic. I love this one. Not everyone can pull this off, but she did. But she did. Stella Maxwell pulled it off, okay? <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Let me know who your best worst dress is at the Amphar Gala. I think a lot of people pulled off their looks pretty well. I love how everybody came through and slayed. Well, I love how most people came through and slayed. <laughs> Check out my earrings, link down below, girl. Follow me on all my socials. Alrighty, girl, bye. <laughs>